Hi everyone, my name is Anya Kelly. I'm the Associate Dean of Undergraduate Science Education at Trinity, which means that I'm responsible for the four science degrees shown here on the right that are offered by Trinity. These are TR060 Biological and Biomedical Sciences, TR061 Chemical Sciences, TR062 Geography and Geoscience, and TR063 Physical Sciences. So our Trinity Science degrees cover all aspects and areas of science that you might be interested in studying. In this presentation, I want to give you an overall view of what studying science at Trinity is like, what you'll learn, and how you can use your science degree after graduation. The first question is, why study science? Science is a wonderful degree to study because it allows us to learn more about ourselves, our planet, the living organisms we share our planet with, and indeed to understand our universe. Science will also help to address some of the major challenges facing humanity and facing the planet, and these encompass all areas covered by Trinity's different science degrees. These challenges include addressing some of the negative impacts humanity has had on the planet, the fact that the Earth's natural resources are being diminished because of our appetite for consumer goods, the serious impact of climate change and pollution on the planet, and also major medical challenges, antibiotic resistance, the fact that we have the technology now to edit the genome, what are the potential ethical consequences of that? And of course, science allows us to create new materials or explore the mysteries of our universe. The importance of science is clearer than ever as we face the challenges posed by COVID-19. Trinity scientists have been at the forefront of Ireland and the world's response to COVID-19, and I'm showing some examples of their work here. Engineers, medical scientists, immunologists, all using their expertise to protect us from COVID and also to explain the science of prevention, diagnosis and treatment to the public. So why should you study science at Trinity? It's summed up by these four words, expertise, facilities, community, opportunity. Trinity has some of the world's best scientists, along with world-class research facilities. And if you study here, you'll be taught by these world-class experts and hear directly from them about the work that they are doing and the new discoveries they're making. Also, when you start your science degree, from day one, you become part of Trinity's scientific community of students, technicians and academics. Your education is a collaborative effort between you and those who are teaching you. That happens whether you're in the lecture theatre, the lab, or even out on fieldwork, depending on your course. You'll also have the opportunity to engage with cutting edge research all the way through your degree, and that culminates in your capstone project, which I'll talk about later. Our present excellence is built on a legacy of achievement. An example of that is our two Nobel laureates in science, Professor Ernest Walton and Professor William Campbell. That reputation for excellence is global. Trinity is the only Irish university and one of only 23 in Europe that is part of the League of European Research Universities, along with Oxford, Cambridge and others that are noted for their achievements in research, the generation of new knowledge. Also, Trinity graduates have outstanding career prospects. We are the number one university in Europe for six years in a row for producing entrepreneurs and our graduates are rated first among employers for reputation and outcome. When you come to Trinity, the education you receive is characterised by seven key features that are built into your entire curriculum and student experience as a science student. Co-curriculum reflection recognises that students learn outside of the classroom through engaging with student life and extracurricular activities such as internships and volunteering. We've developed tools that students can use to identify how these activities shape their personal and academic development. Partners in Learning describes how students develop a teaching and learning relationship with academics during their degree through innovative teaching methods and creative assessment methods. Trinity is an international university that collaborates in global educational and research networks. Global mobility means that in addition to exchange opportunities in different countries, Students will also study with peers and be taught by academic staff from all over the world. Trinity is committed to preparing our students for the ever-changing challenges of the 21st century workplace. Through the employability feature, Trinity supports development of students' research and leadership skills that prepare them for future careers. I'd like to discuss the three remaining features in the context of the science degrees. Open modules, 
Trinity electives and the capstone project. The structure of our four Trinity science degrees is shown here. The structure is similar regardless of which of the degrees you're taking, biological and biomedical sciences, chemical sciences, geography and geoscience, or physical sciences. Students complete 60 credits every year. In the first two years, you'll take a variety of foundation modules before specialising in the third and fourth year in your preferred option. And there are different options open to you depending on which degree you're registered for. In the first three years of your degree, you have the opportunity to take electives or what we call open modules. These open modules are outside your core subject, but are complementary to it. In science, that means that students in different streams can take modules from the other streams. So, if you're a student of biological and biomedical sciences, you have the option to take modules in physics or geoscience. If you're a physical sciences student, you have options to take modules in chemistry or biology. This ensures that even though you're specialising in a particular area of science through your degree, that you receive a broad education in all sciences. You'll also take modules outside of science, for example, in science education and communication, or in the history, philosophy and ethics of science. This is intended to develop breadth and context in your science education, and to highlight the importance of scientific research and discoveries to the whole of society. You also have the opportunity to take modules completely outside of the science curriculum. In science, you can take two Trinity elective modules in your third year. These Trinity elective modules include languages and cultures. You can study a variety of languages, including Korean, Japanese and Irish Sign Language. Other Trinity elective modules cover grand societal challenges, such as cancer, human migration and internet security. And other modules are focused on Trinity's research excellence in all manner of fields. So through the Trinity electives, you have a chance to step completely outside of your area and learn something new from Trinity experts outside your faculty. The final feature is the Capstone Project. This is a scientific research project you'll undertake in your final year alongside one of Trinity's scientific leaders. It's an opportunity for you to make new findings and to make an original contribution to research. And it's the culmination of all of your training as a scientist throughout your four years. So by being exposed to these features of a Trinity education throughout your science degrees, you can broaden your experience perspective beyond your course subjects and deepen your understanding of your own scientific subject. Through them, you develop the Trinity graduate attributes that equip you for your future and for lifelong learning, to think independently, to communicate effectively, to develop continuously and to act responsibly. With these attributes and with a Trinity Science degree, you have many career options. This graph shows the pathways that our students generally take. About a third of our students will become professional scientists. They will undertake further training and generally work in research in universities or in the private sector. About another third don't become scientists, but they use their scientific qualifications directly in other careers like teaching, medicine, scientific, uh, scientific journalism, law, or a variety of other options. And about another third don't use their scientific knowledge in their jobs, but they will use the analytical and other skills they've learned. For example, many of our graduates go on to work in the financial services sector. So as a Trinity student, you have four enjoyable, exciting years to spend learning with us and a bright future ahead. Please check our website for more information about our courses and think Trinity.